Do you want to handle all of your social media pages in just one dashboard and make the whole process a breeze? Well, Napoleon Cat has got you covered. So let's just dive right into it and explore what this tool has to offer us. And this is the website of Napoleon Cat, and here you can see the various features that they've got here, uh, which are very useful, such as social media inbox, auto moderation, schedule and publish, analytics, reporting, and social CRM. Here you can also see the various platforms that they support, such as Facebook, Messenger, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube, TikTok, and more. Here you can see that it is best for every type of business, agencies, e-commerce, small businesses, enterprise and they are also best for teams and collaboration so here you can see the words that they've got as being your team's favorite social media management tool and also besides being a social media management tool it also allows you to assign tasks within this tool in just one dashboard to make a well-informed decision, you might want to explore this to its fullest without paying anything. So for this, you can start your free trial. You need just to sign up. I've already signed up, so I'm logged in here. And just enjoy the endless possibilities that this plugin has in just one dashboard. To get started with Napoleon Cat, first of all, you will need to link a profile to your account. So you can either add it from here at new profile or just go to the workspace settings and add it from there. No difference. So when you click here, you will need to say connect pages and here you will first of all need to um, choose your profile type and then you can add the pages from here. Then let's go to our social media inbox. Uh, workspace and see what we've got here. So first of all, you have many filtering options here. You will get all of your social media messages right here if you want. That's just insane. Here you can make your filtering options. So uh, let's say the time range I want is 99 days. I'm clicking apply and here you can see all the messages appear right here then here you can also choose either newest or oldest first if you want to answer for example the oldest first uh, then here you can also uh, choose which type of content you want to display uh, in your dashboard so maybe you only want the private messages so you will just need to disable these others and then apply the filter right from here then if you want to go deeper and be more specific then you can also choose a sentiment so um, you can choose either the positive comments or the neutral ones or the negative ones and again apply the filters right here you can also uh, choose them based on the assigned moderator so um, if you want to search for the assigned to nobody messages then you can click here and then you then can assign to uh, the moderators Afterwards, you can also set this more filters. You can choose the user status, either messages from bloat, for example, users, or um, you can also tag them, saying if they are competitors or they are trolls who always leave bad comments, etc. And then again, apply those filters here. Um, we've got also many features here, so you can assign user right from here. Here you can see I've signed it to this specific user. You can also tag this message. So it is, for example, complete. Here you can also mark it at the sentiment. Uh, it, it is a negative. Here you can also reply it directly from here. You can uh, leave it to your archives and also you can uh, flag them. So, and when you go to my tasks, here you can see the specific tasks assigned to moderators. The other very important tool is auto moderation tool, which will help you protect your website from bad comments and offensive content. So here I've got two options. Uh, you can either create new rules or you can use the templates right here. For example, we've got templates for automatically hide offensive words on Facebook or automatically hide offensive comments on Instagram. So let's choose this template and see what moderation we can make here. Uh, so first of all, you will of course need to choose the platform and the profile in this case it's this here you can choose the message types I'm choosing organic uh, comments and the condition um, containing for example images and videos uh, 
Um, so here you can see the um, keywords um, that you can introduce, for example, the fancy words uh, that in case uh, Napoleon Cat detects them, then it will automatically just block them or report them. Uh, here you can choose the actions of um, social media, so reply, hide, delete. So um, let's say it's delete. Um, you can also add, for example, reply, etc. You can also choose Napoleon Cat's actions. So you can um, choose it flag or mark as well. Mm -hmm. And then you can go on and also activate this notification bar here. So in case Napoleon Cat detects something and it answers uh, immediately, it is just sent to you so that you can see how it was, uh, for example, tackled this issue. So afterwards, you can also schedule this and that's it. You will just simply save it and run. The other very handy tool that Napoleon Cat has got here is the publisher feature. So first of all, here you can see the publication schedule appear right on your screen where you can navigate through all the posts, either upcoming or the posted ones and just edit them. Uh, and here let's add a uh, publication and see how it works here. Uh, so first of all, we will need to choose an image. Let's choose it. Choose its sizes. Let's save it here. Uh, here we can see the various types that it supports. It supports photos, it supports uh, videos and reels. Um, so here you can also make some other configurations. You can choose the post visibility settings by uh, setting minimum age, etc. or some countries. You can of course schedule the post uh, if you want or either immediately post it. Um, here you will need to choose the date and time. You can assign this to specific users. So let's assign it and see how it works. Uh huh. And here you can see the subscribers. So these people will be notified about the final version and draft of this post. So they can start a discussion here and uh, as an observer and make comments, uh, their suggest suggestions. And here you can see the post preview here. So if you type here anything, it will be displayed here and you will see how it, is, how it looks like. The other tool that Napoleon Cat offers will just save you tons of time and it is reports feature. So when you go here, you can see that this tool can create reports instead of yourself in just relatively short period of time. So I've got one here, which is completed, uh, but we can go on and create a new one. So when you click here, uh, so first of all, you will need to choose a time range. So I will just choose the last se seven days. Uh, you can also choose the language here. You can choose for which profile you want it to be. In this case, it's Facebook. And you need to choose the profile page. Uh, afterwards, you will need to choose uh, what kind of report you want. For example, it is moderator's report or inbox tax statistics. So let's say it is inbox tax statistics. And then you click on generate and here you can see it is in progress and once it's finished you will get an email notification and you can see your report completed. The last tool here on Napoleon Cat is the analytics feature, which will help you constantly keep up with the performance of your social media pages in just, again, one dashboard. So here, first of all, you can see the summary of your pages. And then you can also go deeper and, for example, look at the reach, impressions, engagement separately and make your well-informed decision based on this data here and try to improve the performance of your social media pages. That's it about Napoleon Cat. And if you want to try it out yourself, then just follow the link in the description below and go and enjoy the endless possibilities that this tool has got. And if you've still got any questions concerning Napoleon Cat, don't forget to drop them in the comments and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.